Lucas Media. Don't forget to hit like button and subscribe. So Devin Haney, Devin the Dream Haney, WBC champion, 140 pounds, did an interview, and he was asked about a mega fight with Ryan Garcia. Post fight uh, interview, post fight press conference. My bad, y'all. Devin Haney quote: "I think that's a possibility. That's a mega fight, you know." I've been calling out Ryan for years now. So it's good to hear that, you know, he really want to fight. It sucks that it came after you took an L, but it's only a matter of time. But now he want to, you know, call me out. At the end of the day, it's still a big fight. And like I said, I'm willing to make it. I'm willing to make the, be the best fights, the biggest fights happen. Um, now... This is Devin Haney talking about Ryan Garcia. Ryan Garcia did just have a, uh, a recent victory. However, uh, this past, past April, he took a loss to Javante Tank Davis. And I think it was seven round TKO. So here's my, my point. Now, I do think that Devin Haney and Ryan Garcia will be an awesome match. It'd be a huge fight. But I don't think Ryan's going to take the fight right now. Ryan's going to, since he's at 140 he, and he just had, he just got with Derrick James. They're more likely going to get comfortable up there and they'll pursue other belts before they try to pursue Ryan. I mean, uh, Devin Haney. In this fickle world of boxing, a lot of these fighters now have it to where if you take a loss, it's the end of your career. Even though Ryan Garcia has one loss, if he takes two, then, you know, he might look at it like, oh, uh, people didn't turn their back on me because he still has those millions of followers. Who's to say they'll be around after a second loss? And usually after a second loss, the casual fan will say, oh, he's washed up because he had two losses for whatever reason, right? But, I mean, I, I do think it's a good fight. I do have Devin Haney beating Ryan Garcia. Um, I actually got Tiafimo Lopez being right. I really have Iron Garcia losing to everybody, honestly. Tank, well, he already lost to Tank. T.O., Devin, and Shakur. I have all three of them beat Ryan, at least right now. Ryan has been really distracted a lot. And he did say that his last fight was the most dedicated he's ever been. But then the last fight, it was kind of sloppy. The defense, the, the, the shell he was in. And it, it, whoever is a heavy hitter at 140 is going to hurt him if he in a position like that again. However, again, I do think the fight is possible. I don't think it's going to happen next year, maybe 2025. And, you know, what's crazy is Ryan Garcia is a superstar, but he's never had a belt yet. He's never even been a regular champion. Like, he's never been a WBA regular champion or none of that. Like, he's just off his name alone you know and so i mean that's just my, my quick take on it it is a mega fight but i don't think it's gonna happen soon i'm sure Devin haney knows that juan garcia knows it it's unfortunate but we're gonna have to wait a little longer well that's just my quick two cents on it tell me what y'all think